what the MERD does, you're trying to simulate as realistically as possible a uh, mine emergency disaster. You're trying to prepare your teams and put them in scenarios that they might experience in a real situation. There's 13 miners missing. Red team, get your apparatus loaded up as soon as we get trigger from the command center. We're ready to roll. The thing that sets our MERD apart at Arch Cole is the magnitude. We have mine rescue teams coming from all over the United States. We utilize local company mine rescue teams. MSHA brings emergency response personnel from all over the country. We're committed to doing whatever it takes to protect our employees in any situation. What we've tried to do with this MERD event also is integrate some of the latest technology. This is a T8700. It's a wireless device. This is going to be connected to a command center computer here at the mine office. If they happen to find someone, they can draw a person and say, Miner, okay, and it's time stamped date. Getting those miners out of the mine quicker with this technology would help save a life. Any time that we can incorporate innovation and technology, we take a step forward. also add a realistic component of family centers and media event are people who have to respond to media questions and what they might see in a, uh, a real disaster situation. The missing miners um, recognized that there was, a, there was a rush of air, there were damage to ventilation controls, and there was an elevation in CO levels. All the exercises we participated in over the years really helps to show your strengths. It also shows where you have weakness. So it's an invaluable tool that we, we feel has been used here today. The thing that makes the MERD successful is the total commitment we have to putting that MERD on. At Arch Call, we're committed to do everything we can on the preventive end. It's a drill, it's a training event. We want people to have a dedication to doing whatever it takes not to ever be in this situation. Mm -hmm.